And welcome back to Stalker. Where we left off last, uh, we made it down back to our old stomping grounds in the cordon. Um, yep, our old stomping grounds in the cordon right over here. And we've got to basically bust into this uh, military uh, outpost out here. And basically, um... Yep. Oh, he spotted me. Well... That's why we have a sniper rifle. It's over there. Um, sounds like there's a ton of... Okay, yeah, that's like 400 rounds of 9x18, so, uh... Basically, if you start this game, just head up over that hill, and right there, there'll be all the ammo that you would want. Right there. So we took care of those guys over here. Oh, and those guys are, I think, out for my blood. So... Tells me I'm gonna run out of ammo for this thing before I take these guys on. But And these guys aren't stupid enough to be standing around in the line of fire. The security service of Ukraine is calling all right-minded and loyal citizens to collaborate with the authorities. Report all known cases of stalking. Do not let the looters hide behind your backs. They bring radioactive, unidentified items Got from the zone that are highly dangerous for human health and life. Only with your help can we eliminate this hideous phenomenon. Do not put your lives and the lives of your families at risk for the sake of dubious profit. There we go, this is a little bit more useful. Saw some of these guys hanging around here, so we need to be very careful. We're gonna do some looting too whenever we've got the chance. And yeah, I just picked up um, 545 ammo, but there is a reason for that, uh, which I will get into later. Прикрой, 
Завалим его! Ах ты ж ёб... So we'll, um, I'll actually search those guys off screen and all I'm not being too talkative right now, but, uh... There's actually stuff that, uh, I need to do here, so... But, we're gonna find these, uh, documents real quick and yank them. Nothing interesting in there. But we've got the documents. Now, um, now basically I'm going to search everybody and gank all of what they have weapons wise, well, except for the pistols, which we don't really need. So just like that, so I'm going to gank all of them, and while that does seem a little bit, uh, sorry, while that does seem a little bit spammy, there is a reason for it, so. So I am actually going to make a cut, and when we get back, we will be back, or when I get back, we will be back at the cordon with um, a heavy load of a bunch of weapons and ammo. So, see you then. Okay, well, after the cut, basically what I did is I picked up all those uh, um, AKSUs off of the military guys and uh, ended up selling them to the stalkers here. Now, I think uh, I, I went here earlier, I think I have, because look, you know, this guy's got an AK-74, there's another one wandering around with an AK-74. For, for some reason, these guys will not switch on their shotguns, this guy neither, but I've, all, I've sold them all decent guns. There's a reason for that, which uh, we'll get into a little bit, but first, I'm going to uh, dump off some of this excess stuff at the uh, trader. A collector reward, shall we? You got the loot? So, Mark what any progress on our mutual business? Mission complete. Here's the box from the army outpost. Good, you were a great help. But of course, a thank you won't buy you a piece of bread. Here's three, wait, two thousand pieces of eight and we're square. What? By the way, the soldiers will certainly notice something missing, so things are going to heat up. You better get going, and the faster the better. <coughs> Excuse me, any more special missions for me? Nope, not a thing. I'm here for the job. Two bandits, I'm up for it. Good job. Perfected pistol, I'm up for it. Good job. Sucker John, I'm up for I know I've got one. I'm pretty sure I have one at the bar that I just have stuff stashed around. Interested, okay. And let's trade off, like I said, a lot of this junk. I'm sorry if you're hearing some of that, uh, I have a kitty that got locked in here, and I'm in the middle of recording something, and she's just kind of rummaging around under my desk, so I do apologize. But, we've got all that traded, and he really just doesn't have anything decent for us, so... Not Trade. bad. Some pretty good stuff you've got there. Yeah, I know. So, we are going to take off with that. All right, well, drop by if you get any more. See ya. So... Good hunting, stalker. 
Got some jobs he'll do for him. I may I may do some of that off screen, or at least coming back to get the reward off screen, because we're just really just wandering around the same area. But we got a few more stashes that we can take a look at. So before talking to this guy who seems to be wanting our attention, let's do that. So we'll take that. We'll probably just uh, drop off a bunch of this junk. Whoa. So what does he want? And this ties in with why I armed everybody decently. Oh, listen up, Mart One. You'll come in handy. We could really use some help. Go on. I'm fanatic, and I'm filling in for the leader since Wolf left. A few mercs came by here yesterday, and they were some tough bastages, let me tell you that. They come here and start making serious demands. You've got one day to clear this camp out. It's going to be your new base. Tonight they're coming back, and as you imagine, they won't be in the mood for a chat. So what are you going to do? We're going to set up an ambush, because a direct attack would probably be our asses. They've got the fighting gear and everything. They've got the fighting gear and everything. Plus, they're trained in tactics like you can't even imagine. And all we've got here are little boys. So we've decided to, to just sit tight in these houses and make it look like we're gone. Then, when the right moment comes, we attack. Fighters like you are just the thing we need right now. And we'd make sure to thank you properly after it's all over. You know we're good for it. So, what do you say? Will you help us out? Yeah, why not? Let's spend the rest of the time preparing for the fight. Here's the plan. I'll put the most hopeless rookies in houses and basements and tell them not to make a move. Otherwise, they might just slaughter our own troops. You and me and a couple other, de and a couple other decent shots will take the best positions to have an eye on the area around the fire. As soon as they come close to the fire, we let the bullets fly from everywhere. They'll be coming for the bridge, and I don't think we'll have to wait long. So find yourself a hiding place with a view, then wait, not, then wait for my command. Take a look around, but remember that your odds aren't as good in the, as in the aren't as good in the open. Sorry, I can't talk, talk tonight. It's your call. Okay. Take up your positions. Let's wait for the enemy. Stay alert. Okay, let's find a decent place to uh, attack from. I think I usually go up there in this house. If I can find a way up. That's right, I think it's... Actually, walk. Actually, no. Um, I'm sorry, I'm switching position here a little bit. I'm actually going to go into this house over here, get up on the roof, like so. If I can just find a decent spot. Just wait for it. Wait for it. Look. 
Look at these dumbasses. Man, I can't watch this without cringing. Damn! Guys, attack on the count of five. One, two, three, four, five, fire! What do you mean we failed? We killed them. I don't think. I think Fanatic didn't uh, make it. Dang it. Let's see the guest. Huh. Well, we got a decent stash out of it. Um, I'm kind of leaving money on the table. That kind of sucks. I was hoping for a better outcome like that. Stalker. Chest of Agriprom. Cripes, I was hoping to have uh, been able to help out, but apparently not. Oh. Yeah. Well, I guess sometimes you win, you sometimes you lose. At least, you know, these most of these guys are safe. So let's see if we got any more stashes to take a look at. So we've got this one up here. It looks like in a train car above the uh, bridge here. That'll be a fun one to get. Looks like we also have a few more in the Dark Valley that we can take a look at too. Which... Oh, oh come on. Can't you walk around me, dude? <laughs> so I got a bunch of these stashes over in the Dark Valley that we can find, basically take a trip and find later. Um, we might do that after we go back to the bar, so we need to... I take care of some bandits over there. This guy called the Fiend we're gonna need to take care of. Got bandits at the garbage we need to take care of. Got soldier to take care of. Got some stashes. We've got a lot of stuff that we could just run around and take a look at. So actually, we've got some. Yeah, we've got some stashes and stuff like that we're going to be going to. I think a few of these actually have some pretty good uh, things to take. So, that's going to be... I think the next objective is we're going to go around... Kind of use the garbage as our base over here. And we're going to go take these stashes out all that fun stuff and uh, then we'll go back to the bar give the documents and all that to the barkeep and move on from there we haven't been over here to Yantar yet but there's a stash over there um, don't worry about that just yet because you've got other things to worry about um, we'll we'll get there later so for now I mean the customer was did I uh, Somehow, Joffrey? so you're the bad. No, nope, well, that's right. Good hunting, stalker. So, this will be the last time I'm going to be in the cordon on screen. So, there's some jobs that we're going to be doing for Sidorovich, which I will just go back off screen and do.
So, uh, there's that. But for now, we are going to check out that one last stash on top of that train train car. Then going to burn down and uh, Tell you what, the Desert Eagle is powerful, but the recoil is a bit much because you know to try to make accurate fire on some of these guys, it's kind of a pain in the butt. I'm assuming a. I'm pretty sure we've got military guys hanging out over there. We do. Care of these guys before uh there we go and basically if we don't get into the stash just right, um, we're going to be jumping and falling right into the military dudes, and obviously that's not something you want to do if at all possible. So this is actually how <clears throat> I'm not entirely sure why I wasn't killed in that fall, but I wasn't. But this is honestly, I think, one of the most difficult stashes to get into in the game. Because it's all the way to the pipe at the bottom of this uh, train car that's precariously hanging on the bridge. And unfortunately, there aren't really any controls to climb up something like that. You know, and normally, in reality, you would just... Uh, climb through and be done with it. Well, there is this, uh... There we go. That was some finagling, but we got it. Not a huge reward for, uh, all that effort, but... Supplies are always good. Eh, nothing I'm interested in. Nothing I'm interested in. I'm mainly searching for the stashes off these guys now. Nothing I'm interested in. I'll throw these guys. We'll let those guys have their gun fight. What's going on? Over here? Look at that a uh, kind of a whitish area. You know, that's where neutrals kind of hang out.
got more military guys hanging out around here, so... I'll replenish one of the grenades that I used. Already got a ton of them. Just got a dude over here. A loner, an artifact, so I'll take that artifact, dude. You're not going to be using it. Try to do that somebody. And I think I shot at least one of those guys. It's over there in uh, that garage that uh, we assaulted so long ago. Why not? It'll be fun. But we are running a little low on ammunition now. A little low. Got a bunch of other junk, but uh, ammo is a little light. So. Okay, time to switch to semi-auto. Okay. A ton of bandits here. have stashes that uh, we might want so that's kind of what I'm looking for now so we're we're going stash hunting and how do we go stash hunting we put bullets in bandits and military and anyone who dares shoot at us and Great crappy artifacts off of them for a little bit of money here and there. So that was kind of it. So, ah, and we are hungry a little bit. A thorn, which honestly, if uh, we had a uh, That earlier it would have been a pretty cool artifact to have at this point, but um, now it's just kind of trade bait. So let's uh, eat some bread and some sausage. For lack of better options, our real really only our decent meal. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't talk tonight. It's been a long week. It's a Friday. I just got off of work. Ending a long work week. So, anyway. I think we've collected everything from this area that we need to. So, really? More military dudes? No 
No stash info, seriously. Okay, so we got a ton of guys just kind of wandering in. Whoa, come on, let me in. So, there you have it. Uh, we defended the newbie camp at the Cordon, and we're about to head to the garbage and uh, take on some more, or we'll find some more artifacts and all that fun stuff. However, I need to go back up to the bar and resupply, so I'm going to do that off-screen, and uh, we'll call it an episode, and when we get back, we'll be in the garbage. Oh! Ah, they're shooting at those dogs that I was shooting at before. So when we get back, I'm going to rearm, re-equip, um... Give you kind of an after action report of our time through the cordon and through the dark valley and all that fun stuff and when we get back we're gonna do some stash hunting and some exploring so see you later and once again happy stalking